What is the best strategy for maintaining a smooth surface on our backyard rink for my seven-year-old figure skating fanatic? We put that question to someone who has installed ice rinks professionally for about 10 years. One of the most common questions I get from clients is what it takes to maintain a proper ice surface. I tend to tell them it starts with the base of the ice. You want to start with a minimum five inches of water to get a nice solid ice base. After that, it, all it is is the maintenance of it. So applying it through your garden holes is an option depending on the size and how much water you're going to need. I preferably tell people get a truck in there, fill it up with one shot so that when you apply your thin layers of resurfacing on top of that five inches of base, it's basically going to keep the shape and the original structure of, of the ice itself. Once you're done skating, remove any snow, any chunks of ice that might have came loose. You don't want none of that ice from the skates or any of the snow to start solidifying again because if you pass water on top of that, it will want to take the original shape that's frozen on that ice. With figure skating, you got to be a little bit more detailed on your ice surfaces. The more you maintain it, the more understanding where they're doing their constant turns and where more ice might get chewed up. Those are the key things you want to look at. The hard part about keeping the surface nice and smooth and not bumpy or wavy is how quick you get the water on top of that ice and how easily you can distribute that layer of water throughout the entire surface of the ice. The way people maintain their backyard rinks was through a simple flooding with their hoses, dumping buckets of water on there, even to the extent of bringing out a mop and trying to smooth out the water before it freezes. That's where you're, you're gonna have that trouble of getting that consistent smoothness of the ice because you're not putting the water all on the same time at an easy, at even rate. You're putting it in different areas and as the water moves throughout the ice surfaces, some of it will solidify prior to getting to its final destination, which will be basically along the board's edge. What I recommend is a simple ice resurfacer. It does the exact same application that a Zamboni would do. It's a simple uh, water dispenser with a drag mat. That drag mat is the key thing to getting it nice and smooth because it gives you that nice even surface. 